Today is my first star party and I'm really excited to see what all the fuss is about. There will be many telescopes there ranging from 4 inch all the way to 20 inch. Under a bold rule, Portal 3 Sky. Ideally I want to check out the 12 inch if it's a worthy upgrade from my 8. I also want to play around with some premium eyepieces to see what all the fuss is about. Right. They are a really good idea compared to my... Uh, I think I missed my turn. Exit right. It don't drive and make videos. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, I want to check out three things. I want to find the biggest telescope I can get there and have a look at M51. I gotta see finally some dust lanes of a galaxy. It's the last thing I haven't done yet in astronomy. Second thing, I want to find out what all the fuss is about premium eyepieces, if it's really such a huge difference between all those panoptics uh, and so on, nugglers and my budget eyepieces that I bought for 50 bucks. There will be a difference, but how big? Is it going to be $1,000 difference? Third thing, I want to check out a 12 inch to see if it's worth upgrading from my 8 inch. We'll see. Here we are, lots of telescopes in the background. Let's have a closer look. And that's exactly the telescope I would one day like to have. Someday, maybe. Bye. Hell of a party, it was a really good choice to come here today. There was a line of 10-20 people just to see M51 in the 20 inch 500 millimeter telescope and it was well worth it. Finally I saw dust lanes and another thing, Orion in the big telescope, it was like looking at a picture. Really good. I got my questions answered. 300 millimeter is a really nice telescope to get so maybe I will be buying it I spent a lot of time with the guys with the 400 and 500 millimeter and really uh, amazing stuff the bigger tel the telescope the better of course another amazing thing was the double refractor 150 millimeters boat also amazing we spent some time looking at M4, M13 M92 in all of these telescopes Again, amazing stuff. Seeing M13 in a 500 millimeter 20 inch telescope, really amazing. I can only recommend it. Go and join a star party if you can. The consensus there is like, if you want to get into some real nice structure of the objects, you should start at least with 300 millimeter. As far as premium eyepieces go, I'm not convinced. I'm really not convinced they're worth all that money. I got to test Explore Scientific 100 degrees FOV 
APM 80 degrees, Morpheus 76 degrees, uh, something like that. Maybe the APM 80 degrees was my favorite because it was just enough uh, FOV. I completely get it why some people would prefer a smaller FOV than, uh, than the bigger one. We will see. I will have to see if I am going to invest more money into an eyepiece. Bigger telescope, definitely 100% yes, a great investment. Better eyepiece than what I have in my budget eyepieces, uh, not sure, not sure, we'll see. Over and out, time to drive home. Hope you enjoyed the video, if you like it, click like, <laughs> whatever.